Africa has a lot to learn from the late freedom fighter Winnie Madikizela Mandela. He addressed hundreds of ANC members from across Gauteng attending the Winnie Madikizela Mandela Legacy Lecture that was held at the City Hall in Johannesburg. Montenegro de Poco has this report. The state of the ANC pre Nazare was a matter of grave concern to the late Mama Winnie. This past week, the ANC remembered her life and legacy during what could have been her 82nd birthday. The highlights of the week was a lecture by party president. President Ramaphosa reminded ANC members about the sacrifice of Mama Winnie, who put South Africans first before her own children during the dark days of the brutal apartheid system. She began a life that was characterized by extended periods of detention, extended periods of banishment and banning orders. This was a time when the apartheid system, fearful of the genuine aspirations of black South Africans, unleashed the most brutal measures against those who strove for democracy. Ramaphosa says Mama Winnie had had deep scars inflicted by the apartheid forces unto her life. As we were forced to acknowledge, as we bid farewell to her, her healing from the deep wounds inflicted on her was incomplete. Mamuini continued to carry those very deep, bleeding and gushing wounds of what apartheid did to her. Winima Tikisela Mandela was also praised for committing her entire life to the unity of the people. The president assured his supporters that the ANC will go into the next year's elections united than ever in memory of the late struggle icon, Madikizela Mandela. He promised to honor her with the highest order in the ANC, the AC Tolandre. Muntlingani Dipoku, SABC News, Johannesburg.